Hey, what's up guys? See boys Pilot 2K7 and we are back for a brand new Grand Auto 5 Firefighter mod video. Today we're here at the Davis Firehouse for the Los Santos Fire Department. We're going to be running Rescue 2 as well as Ambulance Number 2. Now, if you guys could see outside, I'm actually going to head to the front of the firehouse real quick. It is pouring down rain right now, guys. So, um, as you guys could imagine, we're probably going to get into a bunch of... Well, hopefully we don't get into accidents, but we're probably going to be responding to a bunch of accidents and calls for helps. And I don't even know. It's storming outside, so I'm pretty sure it's going to be crazy. We are going to be running the rescue today. These two, uh, both of these trucks, both the ambulance and the rescue, come from Mods by Medic Freightliner Mini Pack. And um, yeah, these things look very nice. Awesome pack here. So we'll be running the rescue, the ambulance will be responding with us as needed. Should be a fun day. Uh, let's go ahead and get our shift started and let's see what happens today, guys. We've got a roadway blocked on uh, Elgin Avenue. Units respond code 2. Alright guys, looks like we're getting our first call. Looks like a tree fell, possibly fell on a vehicle. Looks like a person may be trapped. We're going to go ahead and respond to that. Now we're kind of improvising a little bit here guys. It did say respond code 2 for this one. But we're going to go code 3 because it seems like uh, the tree may have hit somebody. Oh, this guy is stuck back there. Come on man, run. Push that hose out the way. There you go. This guy got a convertible in the rain. GTA 5 logic. <laughs> I see the tree down. It looks like the tree actually fell onto a vehicle here. I'm going to go ahead and stop traffic and let's go ahead and take a look and see what exactly we have going on here. Oh wow, alright. So there's one person still inside. Looks like the tree came through the passenger side. Wow, okay. So we're going to have to try to stabilize this guy and while we do that we're going to also have to try to cut the tree out and then try to cut him out. Yeah, this door isn't opening up. Alright, let's get to work. Go ahead and grab my saw. Alright, so we have our saw. Let's go ahead and see if we could start cutting this tree and freeing this guy out. The other uh, firefighters are going to start with trying to stabilize him. Make sure we stabilize his neck before transport. I'm going to work on this tree here. Alright, perfect. We got the tree cleared. So we should be able to get him stabilized. Were you guys able to get the door open? Okay, they were not able to get the door open. So I'm going to see if we could uh, get the door open here. Watch your hands. <laughs> Not the one I wanted to cut. <laughs> Alright, there we go. So we have all of the doors cleared. 
Uh, just for the heck of it. Should we cut this side too? I think we could get them out okay, but this is just kind of cool. So we're just going to remove all the doors while they continue to stabilize them here. Now, this callout is not an official callout from Fire Callout, what we're doing here today. Uh, basically, what we just did was we took the Fallen Tree callout and we just used Menu to spawn a car and kind of make it look like the tree went through the car. If you guys would like to see how I'd set up this video, um, check out my website, acepilot2k7.com. On my website, I actually have a behind the scenes section, and in the behind the scenes section, I actually show how I set all of this up. So, at the time of this recording, it's not part of a uh, fire call outs, but who knows? Maybe panels may add a type of call like this. That would be very cool. Alright, so let's put this away and let's continue working. So, now we should be able to get the guy out. Oh, tripped and fell. Should be able to get the guy out now. Alright, so we got him out. I uh, wish I had a nicer place to set him down, but the way this mod works, we just dropped him on the floor. So let's go ahead and start CPR now. Uh, let's see if we can get him up here. Alright, we got him up. It looks like he's gonna be okay. We're still gonna transport him though. EMS should be on scene shortly to take him. Alright, so we'll transport him all right ambulance is arriving on scene and they should be able to take him probably to the Davis Hospital I think that's the closest location so we'll get a tow truck out for the car Head back to the firehouse. That was a successful rescue. Looks like everybody's gonna be okay. He will be transported to Davis. Okay, perfect. It's pretty crazy how that tree fell down with all this rain, you know. The soil is just so soft right now in these high winds. I forgot to tell you guys too, like if you look at my jacket, you can kind of see how windy it is. It's just blowing my jacket right now. This is crazy. Alright, tow truck is here. Alright. It's time for us to get out of here. Let's go ahead and head back to the firehouse, guys. Our job here is complete. Looks like the uh, ambulance is stuck in traffic over there. Oh, he's forcing his way through. <laughs> Alright, let's move out the way for the ambulance. Oh, watch out. Don't hit us. Oh, oh, oh there it is. <laughs> There it is, alright. We'll head back to the firehouse. And I'd say that was a successful rescue. Let me know what you guys think down below in the comment section. You guys think we did a good job on that one? Alright, we'll make this right on red here. Oh, it actually changed, so we will continue. I love this traffic advisor back here too. Let's 
guy just here doing burnouts. You know what, I should actually change the pattern. It should, because right now it's directing traffic to the left. I should just change it to like that other pattern that's just, um, I gotta pull up the, the keybind stuff, the uh, controller, but I should change it to the pattern that's just like, um, I don't know how to explain it. I'll just show you guys here in a second. That pattern basically, switch it to that one. back at the firehouse and guys that is gonna do it for today's episode i really do hope you guys enjoyed it let me know again what you guys thought of the call out i thought it was a pretty cool idea something unique something i haven't seen yet so hopefully you guys did like it and also if you guys would like to see how i set everything up using menu again check out my website acepilot2k7.com i have a behind the scenes section which give you access to some of my exclusive videos, including how I set up videos, including this specific video. You guys can see how I set it up. That should be up later today as well if you guys are watching this on the day that I uploaded this video. But yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching. Really do hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.